Let's talk about Pinterest. So I will admit to you guys, I have never had the patience for Pinterest. With my e-commerce business, I was already creating content for YouTube, Instagram, and Facebook, and I just didn't have the patience to optimize content for Pinterest. But boy, was I missing out. Apparently, 47% of social media users see Pinterest as a place to discover products and do online shopping. 77% of weekly pinners say that they have discovered a new brand or product on Pinterest. And 50% have actually gone ahead and made a purchase after seeing a promotional pin. So yes, Pinterest is relevant for your e-commerce business, and particularly if your target audience are women. Pinterest users, 77% of them are female and 35% of them are between the ages of 35 to 49 years old. It just so happens that that was my exact target audience. So I was doing my business a huge disservice by not using Pinterest. But my argument still stands. To create and optimize pins for Pinterest just does take more time. That is why I'm excited to share with you Tailwind Create. You've probably heard about Tailwind before because it's a, an extremely popular app um, that helps you to prepare and schedule your pins for Pinterest, but also for Instagram. But what I want to share with you today is Tailwind Create, where you can create designer quality pins faster than ever before. You can literally take a link from your website, a blog post, even your product listing, put it into Tailwind Create, and it's going to pull all the images and instantly create pins um, and use your branding theme to create them. So it's a perfect solution for entrepreneurs like myself who value our time, but also see the value in uh, having a presence on Pinterest, the value it brings for our e-commerce businesses. So let me hop behind my computer to show you how Tailwind Create can help you create pins in a matter of seconds. Right now I'm on Tailwind's website. I just wanted to show you what it looks like. As you can see, not only um, do they help you with Pinterest, but Instagram as well. But I wanted to focus this video today on Pinterest. Um, but if you are growing your Instagram account, this can certainly help you as well. Um, it's a very popular app. You may have heard of it before, trusted by 700,000 plus brands. Tailwind is an official partner of Pinterest and Facebook. So, and Facebook owns Instagram, so you can rest assured that your account is safe. And uh, yeah, so let's dive into Tailwind Create now. So as you can see here, you create beautiful pins faster than ever before. Um, I'm going to get this set up now for the first time with my brand. So the cool thing is that if you have a brand, you've got your logo, you've got your brand colors, you've got a whole theme going on. You don't have to, each time you make a new pin on Pinterest, um, customize it. You set this up one time uh, with your brand name, your fonts, your brand colors, your brand logo, and then Tailwind is going to add these elements to each pin automatically. So this is where you save a tremendous amount of time. So let's do this together for my brand name, Tatiana James. And they have a lot of fonts to choose from, but you can also import uh, any fonts that you wish to use if you have a special font that's not available here. Let's do this one. And brand colors. So my brand colors are actually, huh, it's funny they have it here because this is very similar to my brand color. It's actually a bit more orange than that. I would say that's more like it. Okay, so those are my brand colors and now I'm gonna import my logo and then I'm gonna hit save preferences. Okay, great. So now we are going to add uh, the pin's primary information so that they can create images for me. So this is if I want to create a pin um, let's say I want to create a pin from the images on my website. So I'm just going to put in my website link. Okay, so these are the images on my website. These are some of the images. I'm also going to upload some of my own. Okay, so now that I've uploaded the images that I would like, now I'm going to say create images. Voila! So as you can see here, Tailwind has now created a bunch of different graphics for me uh, based on my branding, my color palette, the text, 
And it's really cool because there's a bunch, there's like a close up, something more distant. Um, it's very modern, very sleek. Um, and I didn't have to put in any effort to create these graphics. I set up the branding once and added a link and added the photos and here we are. So now if I find one that I like, but I'd like to modify something, I can still edit it. I can try different looks too. So I could, you know, remove certain colors or change the photo or even change the layout. So if I want to modify the layout a little bit, it gives me different options. And what I can also do is I can click here and edit it and I can add elements. So if I want to add an arrow, which I don't, or if I want to modify the text or the photo. And I can also uh, change the designs based on my industry. So if I say, for example, my industry is, hmm, let's say health and fitness, then the theme is going to be slightly different uh, for each industry. And so you can get quite specific. If you know what you want, then you can get quite specific here with the filters. So I can also add a call to action. So for example, with your e-commerce store, you of course want to make sure that you're directing people to your website so that they're able to buy your product. So shop now is a great call to action, which means that every uh, pin will have a shop now call to action. And when they click on the ping, they'll be directed to your website or wh wherever you want them to visit. You could also have a learn more right here. So, or get 20% off if you are doing some sort of a sale. And so then you go ahead and you select which ones you want to schedule. So I'm gonna say this one and let's do, I like this one, let's do this one. So then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna review my selection and I can then say, okay, go to schedule if I'm happy with them. And this is where you can now schedule and really get organized. And I really like this. So here's your schedule. These are the pins that are going to be posted today. Okay, I already did that. Um, and I can schedule for all, you know, remaining days. I can decide on, you know, what my schedule is, what times I want to be posting, how often I want to post, how many times per day. Um, and the schedule can go as far out as you want. And so what you do is you then have to enter a description and choose the board that you want to post it on. So let's just say art and the description, la la, because I'm not really pinning these. It's just an example. And then you can just add it to queue, which simply means that it's going to be the next pin uh, based on the schedule. So for example, now this should show up in the 415 slot it showed up here in the 922 slot. Okay, so we'll do the same thing here. And you can also, if you don't wanna just add it to the next slot, if you want a specific time or day that you want it to go out, you can custom set the, the day. So let's say the fourth and set custom time and then schedule. And there you go, it's now showing up on the fourth. So this is going to be posted on the fourth. And then you can go here and you can see all of your scheduled pins. And so this is great if you also say, for example, you're not managing your social media, you have outsourced this and you have hired someone to pin your pins on Pinterest, you can still get them access to Tailwind and it makes their lives easier. It helps them create better content, helps save them time, which essentially is going to help save you money if you're paying them on an hourly basis. And it's a great way for you to kind of uh, overlook the work that they're creating because ultimately what they pin is a reflection of your brand and you want to make sure they're doing a good job. So you can look at the schedule very easily. You can see the pins. You can kind of browse through, see if there's anything that needs to be changed or any feedback you have. Um, so it's it works great if you are someone who is personally going to be pinning or using Pinterest yourself and publishing or if you've hired someone to do this for you. So then you can grant them access to the app. All right, guys, so I hope that you enjoyed this video. Um, I'm always open to discovering new apps or tools that are going to help me with my business. Uh, I'm more than willing to pay for softwares or hiring people um, so that I can delegate and I can focus on the things that are going to move the needle in my business the most. 
As an entrepreneur, it's your responsibility to be able to identify where your time is worth spent, being spent and what are the things that you don't need to be spending your time on. And quite frankly, you know, if you're still doing the social media yourself, I would probably outsource that and hire someone else to do it. Depends on where you are with your business. Um, but you can also hire someone and give them access to Tailwind. Um, as I mentioned in the video, it's a great opportunity for you because not only is it going to save them time in creating the graphics, but you can monitor their work. You can see the schedule. Um, so it works for you if you want to be creating the pins yourself, but it also works if you hire, hired someone to, to do your social media for you. You can kind of pass that on to them. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this video and enjoyed this recommendation. You guys can get Tailwind for free. You can try it for free. There's a free trial. Uh, you can go to tatianajames.com slash tailwind. I'll also link it in the description box below. You don't need to input your credit card information in order to take advantage of the free trial, which is great. Um, so try it out, see how you feel, and if you like it, great, continue to use it. Um, if not, nothing is lost. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Any questions, comment down below. I'd love to answer them. Otherwise, I will see you in my next video. Bye-bye.